Are you proud to see the film finally on screen? Yes, I'm really proud. I'm really proud and I'm really honored to be part of the film and yeah, I'm really glad. This is my first time watching it, so. Oh, this yeah, is your first time? first time. Well, I've seen a snippet of it, but not the full version, so like, um, I've been kind of holding it off and just wait for this moment. Are you proud that what, what Christopher did for, for you guys and, and, and happy of, of what he the message that he, he put on, on the screen for you? Yeah, I'm really proud actually because he showed a lot of important stuff that I think our community and not, not I mean just our home community, but a lot of uh, just our, our United States community, just to the world in general, haven't really seen much about uh, how, how much hip hop impacted just the youth in general and our home community in general and how, mu how much positive that is and just just the amount of education, uh, 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 information that he had in the film is really good. Yeah. Oh, uh, what's up? My name is uh, Steven, uh, aka Villain. So I was yeah. talking to your brother about how long it took. It took a while for this film to get on, on the screen, and how does it feel to see that see yourselves on on the screen, and how did it feel to to see uh, the punk people being uh, depicted on screen as the b-boys also? Amazing, amazing. I, I I feel like you know we we. I've always wanted something like this to happen, especially in our community, to, to, to uh, expose our Hmong community, and especially with, in the arts, you know, as, and we're, we're, we're doing, you know, we're b-boying, so I've always wanted to, you know, uh, showcase that to the Hmong community and to other people, so they can understand that, yeah, you know, how hip-hop has, uh, has played an impact to our lives, and so other people, you know, because in a documentary, a lot of people don't understand, especially in our, in our culture, they don't understand what b-boying is. So I hope that this documentary can go and uh, help educate those people who don't know, you know, how, how, how the, big, the big impact it has done to our, our Hmong youth. Right, right. Now, a lot of other people, they, there's, everybody else knows about other Asians like Filipinos, yeah. Japanese, Korean b-boys and all that. And this is more going to bring a little, a little bit more light to the Hmong community yeah, in itself. Sure. Yeah, so that's one thing I'm really excited about too. Because um, b-boying has always been something really big in the Hmong community, and for this, for it to be this big, you know, I, I'm, I'm so, I'm so happy, and you know, I hope that, you know, maybe I hope that a lot of people could come and check out, you know, our culture and learn about our culture, you know. And I think it's, yeah, I mean, Hmong people, they're, they're everywhere, but they're so scattered, you know. Right. So, uh, as far as getting everybody together, you know, I hope this is what this film could do that. Yeah. to bring everyone together. Now I asked your brother also, how do you feel about what Christopher did for you guys? Did you, you are you proud of, of how he depicted you and how he, he brought it to the screen? Yeah, I think what Chris did was such an amazing job. Like I honestly, like me as, a, as, if, as an artist, I think he did a great job because you know, not only did he tell the stories of b-boys, you know, Hmong b-boys and their, their stories, but he also, you know, gave a brief history of the Hmong people and our story, our history. You know, and uh, people, I, th I think that's very important, you know, um, as far as, because you got to know who we are before, you know, you, kn you know us individually. So I think Chris did an amazing job. And so what, what are you guys doing now? Are you guys still doing uh, competitions? Have, have you guys been able to parlay that into something professional or whatnot? Yeah, I, um, my brother and I, we, we, we've been really busy with school, <laughs> honestly. Yeah. We're trying to finish school. Uh, we're, I'm done uh, this month, actually, so I'm so excited. My in brother's two weeks. Yeah, two weeks in two out. weeks, yeah. So we have two, two more weeks of school and then we're done. Uh, my brother is actually be done uh, at, the end of this, year, yeah, yeah. at the end of this year. Yeah, I'll be yeah so, but other, other than that, so about b-boying and dancing, like, I don't know. I don't know where it's gonna go, but we have, we're, we're trying to, There's you know, a lot of, there's a lot of big plans that we have for, yeah. in store for next year. Right now, we just want to knock something really big and important to us, which is education and which is school. Right, yeah. So right now, uh, but for sure, we have um, on a on a. There's a lot of stuff on our underground that we've been really holding back. Yeah. But one thing that's really important that uh, we're we're doing right now is uh, like we mentioned um, inside uh, the theater, with, uh, our crews underground full 10 year anniversary is coming up. Right. That's really important for us. Yep. Uh, July 16th. So July yeah. 16th, y'all so can make it. Yeah. So Where 10 you? years in Sacramento. So okay, you got so you got to shut that out. Where, yeah. Where can they find you at Twitter, Facebook, all that good yes. stuff? Yes, uh, you can find all the information on breakingroots.com. That's uh, breakingroots.com. So yeah, so check it out and all the information on yep. there. And we got we, this is going to be a real family-oriented event. It's only five dollar. You get in, or if you bring your parents, you get in free. So yep. we're just trying to do that. It's really good for uh, 
the community, just trying to bring everybody together, just have a good time like how uh, when we was growing up as a, uh, you know, as, as a youth, Hmong youth, as a b-boy artist, a b-boy, um, you know, just, yeah, yeah, yeah. just bring I everybody mean, back and just have fun. And I, I, I think parents need to see yeah. their kids yeah. and their talent. So right, right. bring a parent, get them free. Yeah. Your kids are talented.